Hello and welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for stopping by. If you are a new person visiting this channel, please take your time to subscribe. We are a growing family. Join us if you are a subscriber. I just want to say thank you so much and God bless you. So I'm out in a piece of land. And today I want to talk about something very, very nice about Africa, about Zambia. And I want to share some things of what you can do when you go to africa especially if you go to these countries that are so vast and rich in wildlife zambia is one of them we have zimbabwe we have kenya we have botswana we have namibia we have a lot of them i can number but a few in fact i would just say almost all africa is a wildlife place so specifically let's say africa but in brackets zambia so most of the things if you ever if you're that person like you are eager like you just want to visit africa at some point please don't come back if you don't do these things i'm just trying to help you to do a to-do list so that you don't miss the things of course you can do a cruise but a cruise is something you also do in europe but obviously you would need one because there the cruise is different because you get to see crocodiles you get to see other animals like hippos that live in the water and stuff like that you can even meet elephants crossing the sea or the river whatever it is and then you can also take time to eat a lot of african food which are very rich very mineral very natural and this is where you don't go wrong and one of the food you need to eat is gum meat or wildlife meat make sure you eat wildlife meat if you go to africa and you don't eat wildlife meat it's like you never visited at all because this is something you can never have in europe you can never have it if they have it they will cage it it's it's for their purpose they'll just keep it but in africa we have a lot like in zambia they even give you time to hunt those things down as, as long as you have a license you can hunt some and sell some if you don't you've never eaten um wildlife you are missing out wildlife meat things like impla kudu you can have hippo and so vita yeah so you can ask wherever you are to have somebody recommend for you what the best gum meat they have wherever you are then in zambia specifically you can eat what we call chikanda i'll try by all means to link up pictures of what i'm talking about you can eat chikanda these are like african roots prepared in a nice way and they turn out to look like beef you can never know that it's not beef it's roots if you're not told yeah a lot of things you can have a lot of vegetables mixed with groundnuts you will never go wrong visit the mighty zambezi river do a lot of things go to parks go to kafiwa national park where parks cross all over the place or all, all over the tarmac they are not restricted go to everywhere you can go to the lower zambezi go to kaleni hill from the source of the zambezi river where zambia comes from because the zambezi river is the pride of zambia that's why zambia is called zambia because of that river so if you go to the source or you visit that river or you just have a boat cross over that river it's like you are riding above zambia you are on that ego which is on the flag you can imagine the love you can imagine that's why we call it the mighty zambezi river it's mightier than all you can imagine we have a lot of big rivers we have the kafue we have the luangwa we have the kabompo we have chambishi but zambezi is the mightiest of them all you can visit zambezi place also it's nice it has a nice beach you can look at a lot of hotels a lot of lodges that are in the outskirts of the country and enjoy your lovely stay enjoy your lovely stay and please don't if uh, you can also have beef because beef in zambia tastes very different from the one you eat in europe or in the u.s because it's kept very different under different conditions so test beef test fish have dry fish all types of vegetables enjoy your stay forget what people are saying about the dirty my god my god go there and see for yourself you will never go wrong you can go to south africa also visit cape town visit a lot of places 
a lot of places zanzibar Jobek, visit pretoria explore the world and be happy visit namibia go to windhoek where they are brewing all kinds of beer when we talk about a lot of we have windhoek beer we have amster i think those are coming from namibia you will never go wrong go to simple malawi peaceful and nice those are pl places you need to visit you can go to botswana it's all nice because botswana from kasane district as you enter from zambia going inside to nata francis town gaboroni which is the capital city mauni everywhere is very nice because i've been there you can do tenting lodge you can lodge at a tent uh, and just be happy explore africa and be happy so thank you for watching my videos i'm glad that i can share something with you please if you know anything about africa that i left out please write it in the comment section and let me check it out i love you everybody and god bless